Good afternoon, everyone. I hope everyone is having a very fantastic beard day. Because today here with Simon C. Gaming, it is always a beard day. As you know, I am Simon C. You can follow me here on Twitter, Instagram, and Twitch. Oh gosh, I'm all... I've got so many reviews, guys. I hope everyone's having a wonderful day. Today, as you see, we are heading back back over to the Shire with Fable Beard Co Company Beard Co and today we are going to be checking out the collector. Let's go ahead and we'll take it out right there, the collector. One of the one of the seasonal lines I believe that these guys have dropped for the holiday season, the Halloween season also. As you can see, very nice looking design there. Kind of a little creepy, you know. I love it. As you see the scent profile, we got a fresh pomegranate oak barrels with vanilla rum. If you guys want to check this out, you can head over there. I'll put a link in the description below. $18 right now on sale. That's actually a really good deal. As always, these guys have great products. I've never had an issue out of them. When you guys order it, this is the bottle right here. As you can see, that nice little logo. Nice good size bottle as always with Fable. And when you You could actually get a it's very subtle with the collector, and that's a little different, especially with Fable, because usually their scents are very predominant. Like you can get a good smell of them. So compared to the other ones that I've used, this one is actually a little a little bit softer in its scent profile. Like I can somewhat smell the pomegranate. Yeah, I mean I could you could subtly smell that pomegranate in it. I mean, and you can also smell the vanilla that's in it as well, which I mean that's a very good combination. Um so on the scent profile, I'm just gonna get I, I gotta get I mean it's about a Two and a half to three. I mean, like I said, it's not very strong compared to their other ones, which, I mean, it's a lot of people like that. That's not a problem. I'm not saying it's a problem. I'm just saying if you're used to a very predominant scent from these, like you know, like you normally would get, this one you, you may be a little thrown off with. As far as the scent longevity... It stayed, like always, it stayed with me. It did, it stayed not as long as some of the other ones, but I think that's also where the scent profile was a little toned down for this one. That it, it kind of seemed like it faded away. I've had people walk by and you can, you know, when I walk by at work and people at the office are like, okay, when I'm, you know, I'm in the factory, you know, doing that kind of stuff, I walk through my uh, office and the guys are still there. They're like, okay, we can still smell you, dude. Because I have the guys tell me, can you still smell my beard oil? They think I'm weird. It's kind of funny because I do this. They're like my test dummies. My family liked, you know, my wife liked it. She said it was it was very nice, very subtle. Like I keep using the word subtle because with this one, it, it is. It's very, it's toned down compared to the other ones. And I'm not saying that's a bad thing. Um, so on the longevity, I'll give it about three, three and a half, you know. Because, like I said, where it is toned down to begin with, it is going to seem like it's gone away when it really hasn't. Um, I keep looking at the, I keep looking at the bottle. I mean, look at this. I mean, that the design itself. I mean, whoever comes up with these designs, I mean, <clears throat> I, I'm I'm actually really amazed at the artwork. That 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 goes a long way. I mean, I like simplicity. But at the same time, I mean, artwork really can grab your attention, which is one reason I grabbed this one at first, you know, for the review and everything. But that artwork really grabbed my attention. I was like, okay, that's different. Let's check this out. So, FYI, if you guys are out there making, you know, your oils and stuff, every once in a while I'll throw something out there that's really eye-catching with a very good scent, and I guarantee you people will gravitate to it. That's just me, you know. I, you always shop with your eyes first, and then you kind of, it's like food, you always eat with your eyes first, you know what I mean? So, 
like I said, the it's very subtle in how it is. Very, very well, you know, kept my beard nice, you know, as always with Fable. Very nice, very soft. A lot of these, you know, I've noticed a lot of these with Fable, they kind of, they're all about the same when it comes to that. They're going to keep it soft. And I guarantee you if you get the beard butter, not the wax, but the beard butter to go with these, it's going to complement everything very well. And I'm thinking down the road, I may actually go back and get some of the beard butters to try for you guys and let you know how they complement these uh, profiles that I've been doing here. I mean, if you guys want to see a specific one that you like that we've done so far or one that you want to see, leave a comment down below. Let me know what you guys like and what you think about this if you've ever used this one. Um, if you've used the beard butter in combination with it, tell me your experience with it. You can you know, hit me up on Instagram, Simon C Gaming, Twitter, Simon C Gaming. Let me know what you guys think of this oil. If you've tried, or if you, if you're intrigued to try it because of this, let me know too, because that shows me, you know, hey, people are paying attention and people are wanting to try out what you know what we're doing here. You know, I'm trying to fix a piece of cable here. Sorry about that. Got one of my cables loose. I finally got, you know, some Warzone downloaded. So you can check that over on Twitch. I'll be doing that over there every Friday about 8.30 in the morning on the East Coast. Um, but, yeah, with these guys, like I said, it's the packaging is always real simple. You always get one of, you, one of these little personal. And I've not opened this one from the last cycle that I bought from these guys just to show you because... That right there, it's kind of it's kind of hard to see. I'm trying to get the best shot I can. That's a wax stamp. I don't know if you guys like they'll they'll drip like candle wax after on an envelope, and then they have a stamp. You know back you know back in Renaissance days they would in Victorian era. They would you know the higher ups would stamp. So you knew it was like the seal of the state. You know you knew who it came from. And I really think that is really awesome that they do that because it kind of goes with the gimmick of what Fable is. And every every one of these oils and, you know, characters that they bring, their adventurers as they call them, every one of them has a backstory to kind of help you realize and live this, you know, adventure through their oil that they do. And I think that's really cool. So... I'm just trying to think, man. They got so much stuff. You guys need to go check them out. Fablebeardcode.com. I'll put a description link in the description down below. To where if you guys want to pick this up yourselves, you can. It's $18 right now. That's a really good deal. Usually takes about five to seven days. I think I got this one because I think I ordered it on a weekend. So it took about nine days with their standard shipping, which really isn't bad. Considering, especially with everything going on nowadays, to still be able to get these orders out the way they are. And they just moved to a bigger facility, which means they're going to have a bigger stock of their stuff to where they can ship out a lot faster. They're going to be creating the wizard, as they call, as he calls himself. You know, he is the wizard of the, Fa you know, of Fable Beer Co. He creates these scents. You know he's going to be coming up with a lot more crazy ideas coming out of the mines when it comes to uh, scent designs and everything like that, because I've got another one that we're going to be doing down for these guys here soon. You guys could check out if you're not already like and subscribe. That way you can get notifications when we do all these beard oil reviews and down the road, we'll be doing some beard butter reviews. I have a feeling because I've gotten a few different comment or comments directed emailed to me about, you know, Hey, you need to try this beard butter with it. It makes it really good. And I am hearing it. We are going to go down and we're going to go back and look at it to take a look and see what else is with, you know, how these things complement each other. So, like I said, on the scent profile, about 3, 3.5, somewhere in that area. On the longevity, the scent profile, 2.5 to 3, like I said, very, very subtle compared to their other oils that they do. Um, I, but all in all, I mean, very good product. If you're like if you're new to the beard game and you're trying to make your beard stand out and you want it to keep going looking nice, 
you definitely want to check these guys out. Very good stuff. They have so many different scents to choose from. And they also have a ladies line for shave butter, shave oils. Um, uh, what is it? Oh, my God. I can't remember what the name of it is. Now I'm going to have to look this up. Stay with me. We're going to figure this out. I'm going to pull this up together. Here we go. Women's line. Uh, give me the whole thing. Okay. We're just going to pull one of them up. They have the hair tonic. There it is. That's the... I could not think... Here, I'm going to pull that up right there. This is just one of their ladies' lines, the Enchantress. So, man, if you if your women like having that good kind of scent and you're already getting your beard oil from here, they also have a women's line. And, ladies, you know, they have three different types. They have the Enchantress, the Gypsy, and then they have the Nurturer. I've not tried these yet, well, because, you know, I don't do some of this kind of stuff. But I am really thinking about getting it for my wife and letting her check this stuff out because I think she, she'd enjoy it. And if we do, I'll definitely have her on here and we'll let her let you guys know what she thought of the stuff if we even go down that road. But they have all sorts of different products, man. As you saw when I was looking, they have all sorts of adventures. But... Guys, I hope everyone has a very safe and happy beer day because every day is a beer day here with Simon C. Gaming. If you guys like what you see, let me know below if you've used this or if you're thinking about using it. Leave a comment and let me know how you know, your results turn out and what you guys think. And guys, my name is Simon C. Gaming. I will see you on the next episode.